The Tamil script, Tamil Arikuvati Tamil Arikuvati, T, M it, U I, pronunciation is an Abugida script that is used by Tamils and Tamil speakers in India, Sri Lanka, Malaysia, Singapore, Indonesia, and elsewhere to write the Tamil language, as well as to write the liturgical language Sanskrit, using consonants and diacritics not represented in the Tamil alphabet. Certain minority languages such as Saurashtra, Badaga, Irula, and Paniya are also written in the Tamil script. Characteristics The Tamil script has 12 vowels, wirelitu wirelitu, soul letters, 18 consonants, mayelitu mayelitu, body letters, and one special character, the H, Ida Alutu A the Alutu, Tamil version of Visarga, H is called Aku, Akku and is classified in Tamil orthography as being neither a consonant nor a vowel. However, it is listed at the end of the vowel set. The script is syllabic, not alphabetic. The complete script, therefore, consists of the 31 letters in their independent form and an additional 216 combinant letters, for a total of 247 combinations, uyurmayelitu uyurmayelitu, soul body letters, of a consonant and a vowel, a mute consonant, or a vowel alone. The combinant letters are formed by adding a vowel marker to the consonant. Some vowels require the basic shape of the consonant to be altered in a way that is specific to that vowel. Others are written by adding a vowel-specific suffix to the consonant, yet others a prefix, and still other vowels require adding both a prefix and a suffix to the consonant. In every case, the vowel marker is different from the standalone character for the vowel. The Tamil script is written from left to right. History. The Tamil script, like the other Brahmic scripts, is thought to have evolved from the original Brahmi script. The earliest inscriptions which are accepted examples of Tamil writing date to a time just after the Ashokan period. The script used by such inscriptions is commonly known as the Tamil Brahmi, or Tamili script, and differs in many ways from standard Ashokan Brahmi. For example, early Tamil Brahmi, unlike Ashokan Brahmi, had a system to distinguish between pure consonants m in this example and consonants with an inherent vowel ma in this example. In addition, according to Iravatha Mahadevan, early Tamil Brahmi used slightly different vowel markers, had extra characters to represent letters not found in Sanskrit, and omitted letters for sounds not present in Tamil such as voiced consonants and aspirates. Inscriptions from the 2nd century use a later form of Tamil Brahmi, which is substantially similar to the writing system described in the Tolkapiyam, an ancient Tamil grammar. Most notably, they used the pulley to suppress the inherent vowel. The Tamil letters thereafter evolved towards a more rounded form, and by the 5th or 6th century, they had reached a form called the early Vatilutu. The modern Tamil script does not, however, descend from that script. In the 6th century, the Pallava dynasty created a new script for Tamil, and the Grantha alphabet evolved from it, adding the Vatilutu alphabet for sounds not found to write Sanskrit. Parallel to Pallava script a new script Chola Pallava script, which evolved to modern Tamil script again emerged in Chola territory resembling the same glyph development like Pallava script, but it did not evolve from that. By the 8th century, the new script supplanted Vatilutu in the Chola resp. Pallava kingdoms which lay in the north portion of the Tamil-speaking region. However, the Vatilutu was still continued to be used in the southern portion of the Tamil-speaking region, in the Shara and Pandyan kingdoms until the 11th century, when the Pandyan kingdom was conquered by the Cholas. With the fall of Pallava kingdom, the Chola dynasty pushed the Chola Pallava script as the de facto script. Over the next few centuries, the Chola Pallava script evolved into the modern Tamil script. The Grantha and its parent script influenced the Tamil script notably. The use of palm leaves as the primary medium for writing led to changes in the script. The scribe had to be careful not to pierce the leaves with the stylus while writing because a leaf with a hole was more likely to tear and decay faster. As a result, the use of the pulley to distinguish pure consonants became rare, with pure consonants usually being written as if the inherent vowel were present. Similarly, the vowel marker for the Kareel Ukaram, a half-rounded U which occurs at the end of some words and in the medial position in certain compound words, also fell out of use and was replaced by the marker for the simple U. 
The pulley did not fully reappear until the introduction of printing, but the marker Kareel Ukaram never came back into use although the sound itself still exists and plays an important role in Tamil prosody. The forms of some of the letters were simplified in the 19th century to make the script easier to typeset. In the 20th century, the script was simplified even further in a series of reforms, which regularized the vowel markers used with consonants by eliminating special markers and most irregular forms. Relationship with other Indic scripts The Tamil script differs from other Brahmi-derived scripts in a number of ways. Unlike every other Brahmic script, it does not regularly represent voiced or aspirated stop consonants as these are not phonemes of the Tamil language even though voiced and fricative allophones of stops do appear in spoken Tamil. Thus the character kk, for example, represents k, but can also be pronounced or, x, based on the rules of Tamil grammar. A separate set of characters appears for these sounds when the Tamil script is used to write Sanskrit or other languages. Also unlike other Brahmi scripts, the Tamil script rarely uses typographic ligatures to represent conjunct consonants, which are far less frequent in Tamil than in other Indian languages. Where they occur, conjunct consonants are written by writing the character for the first consonant, adding the pulley to suppress its inherent vowel, and then writing the character for the second consonant. There are a few exceptions, namely kasa kasa and shri shri. ISO 15919 is an international standard for the transliteration of Tamil and other Indic scripts into Latin characters. It uses diacritics to map the much larger set of Brahmic consonants and vowels to the Latin script. Letters Basic consonants Consonants are called the body letters. The consonants are classified into three categories, valinum hard consonants, melanum soft consonants, including all nasals, and itainum medium consonants. There are some lexical rules for formation of words. The Tolkapiam describes such rules. Some examples, a word cannot end in certain consonants, and cannot begin with some consonants including R, L and L. There are two consonants for the dental N, which one should be used depends on whether the N occurs at the start of the word and on the letters around it. Historically, one N was pronounced as an alveolar consonant, as is still true in Malayalam. The order of the alphabet strictly abugida in Tamil closely matches that of the nearby languages both in location and linguistics, reflecting the common origin of their scripts from Brahmi. <laughs> Grantha consonants used in Tamil The Tamil speech has incorporated many phonemes which were not part of the Tolkapiam classification. The letters used to write these sounds, known as Grantha, are used as part of Tamil. These are taught from elementary school and incorporated in the Tamil Nadu government encoding called Tamil All Character Encoding TACE16. There is also the compound Shri, Shri, equivalent to Shri in Devanagari. In recent times four combinations of Tamil basic letters are generally used to depict sounds of English letters F, Z, and X and the KH sound in Arabic, Persian. This is helpful for writing English and Arabic names and words in Tamil. The combinations are HPA for F, HA for Z, H for X, and for KH. For example, Esif. Asipazaradine Ajarutan Rex Reis Genghis Khan Senkis Hakan There has also been effort to differentiate voice and unvoiced consonants through superscripted and subscripted integers, 1, 2, 3 and 4 standing for the unvoiced, unvoiced aspirated, voiced, voiced aspirated, respectively, this was used to transcribe Sanskrit words in Sanskrit Tamil books. For example, Ka 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 Kha Ka Ga Ka Ga This extension of Tamil script is not yet recognized by Unicode. The place where the numbers should be placed is immediately neighboring the root consonant character. Fonts currently renders them as kau or kao on possible permutations. Topic: 
Topic: <laughs> Vowels. Vowels are also called the life uyir or soul letters. Together with the consonants may, which are called body letters, they form compound syllabic abugida letters that are called living letters uyir may, i.e. letters that have both body and soul. Tamil vowels are divided into short and long, five of each type, and two diphthongs. Topic: <laughs> Compound form. Using the consonant k as an example, the special letter h, represented by three dots and called atha alutu or akh, is the visarga. It traditionally served a purely grammatical function, but in modern times it has come to be used as a diacritic to represent foreign sounds. For example, hba is used for the English sound f, not found in Tamil. The long nettle vowels are about twice as long as the short curl vowels. The diphthongs are usually pronounced about one and a half times as long as the short vowels, though some grammatical texts place them with the long nettle vowels. As can be seen in the compound form, the vowel sign can be added to the right, left or both sides of the consonants. It can also form a ligature. These rules are evolving and older use has more ligatures than modern use. What you actually see on this page depends on your font selection, for example, Code 2000 will show more ligatures than Latha. There are proponents of script reform who want to eliminate all ligatures and let all vowel signs appear on the right side. Unicode encodes the character in logical order, always the consonant first, whereas legacy 8-bit encodings such as TSCII prefer the written order. This makes it necessary to reorder when converting from one encoding to another. It is not sufficient simply to map one set of code points to the other. Topic Compound table of Tamil letters The following table lists vowel uyir or life letters across the top and consonant may or body letters along the side the combination of which gives all Tamil compound uyirme letters Topic <laughs> numerals and symbols Apart from the numerals 0 to 9, Tamil also has numerals for 10, 100 and 1000. Symbols for day, month, year, debit, credit, as above, rupee, numeral are present as well. In Unicode The Unicode range for Tamil is U plus OB8O U plus OBFF. Gray areas indicate non-assigned code points. Most of the non-assigned code points are designated reserved because they are in the same relative position as characters assigned in other South Asian script blocks that correspond to phonemes that don't exist in the Tamil script. Like other South Asian scripts in Unicode, the Tamil encoding was originally derived from the ISCII standard. Both ISCII and Unicode encode Tamil as an abugida. In an abugida, each basic character represents a consonant and default vowel. Consonants with a different vowel or bare consonants are represented by adding a modifier character to a base character. Each code point representing a similar phoneme is encoded in the same relative position in each South Asian script block in Unicode, including Tamil. Although Unicode represents Tamil as an abugida all the pure consonants consonants with no associated vowel and syllables in Tamil can be represented by combining multiple Unicode code points, as can be seen in the Unicode Tamil syllabary below. In Unicode 5.1, named sequences were added for all Tamil pure consonants and syllables. Unicode 5.1 also has a named sequence for the Tamil ligature Shri, shri the name of this sequence is Tamil syllable SHRII, and is composed of the Unicode sequence U plus OBB6 U plus OBCD U plus OBB0 U plus OBC0. Programmatic access Tamil script can be manipulated using the Python library called OpenTamil. See also Simplified Tamil script Tamil phonology Tamil keyboard Tamil braille 
Tamil letters on Tamil wikibooks Tamil numerals Tamil units of measurement Grantha script Tamil bell Malayalam script equals equals notes <laughs>